What is going on YouTube? This is Gavin21202 aka Gavin Rolandi here bringing you all of the latest WWE news, rumors, outlines, and updates. Ladies and gentlemen, breaking news has just come to my eyes, ladies and gentlemen. Now, ladies and gentlemen, like I just said, breaking news has just come in in regards to Paul Heyman possibly double-crossing Brock Lesnar at SummerSlam and joining Roman Reigns and helping Roman Reigns to win the Universal Championship. So, ladies and gentlemen, as we know, Lesnar, Reigns will square off once again. But, ladies and gentlemen, Paul's Heyman, Paul Heyman's role throughout this feud has been booked magnificently, as Bleacher Report is saying. So often, the go between when it comes to Lesnar's opponents and the champion, Heyman has not only been made to look vulnerable, but for arguably the first time in a long time, completely dispensable. Heyman and Lesnar work together like a marriage made in heaven. Coming from Bleacher Report, that is a quote from Bleacher Report, and as a team, they are a fairly unstoppable force, but Brock has been seen to show a side of persona recently that hints that he doesn't need his advocate Paul Heyman any longer. When he pleaded with Lesnar to head to the ring recently on Raw to save his own job, Lesnar showed such contempt that it was like the two had never met. And while there was apparent reunion on the go-home taping of Raw with Heyman spraying Roman in the eyes before Lesnar took the big dog out, that could simply have been the trick the audience into believing the two are a stronger force than ever. Now, ladies and gentlemen, a tweet was brought to Bleacher Report's attention that they posted, and it says, and I quote, it says, My gut says that Heyman is double-crossing Lesnar. I was against it, but I'd love to... Love for Monday to have been a ruse between Heyman and Roman. Reigns never tore up the offer, and we don't know what was said in Samoan. Now, ladies and gentlemen, one of the great mysteries about Monday's segment is that the note Heyman handed Reigns, what was it written on? With that being said, was it the warning that he was going to spray him, only to insist he's on Roman's side, not Brock's on Sunday? That being said, WWE fans have seen a brand new side to Paul Heyman as of late. As mentioned, not only has they been extremely vulnerable in terms of his booking, but he has been emotionally charged too, as seen in his recent interviews with Renee Young. Uh, in his recent one, he was seen crying, uh, but... Ladies and gentlemen, with that being said, Heyman was all moved to tears when quizzed about his relationship with Lesnar and how it appeared to be falling apart. With Lesnar's future still unclear, it's evident that the time is right for Heyman to appreciate the fact he needs to switch allegiances and back to the right house. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, if Brock Lesnar chooses to sign a new contract, which we probably won't know until after SummerSlam, deciding if he wins or not, I would have to say if he does sign a new contract, I would have to say that he will be staying with Paul Heyman. But I believe if the WWE goes along and has Reigns win, this would be the perfect way to turn Reigns heel. Have him uh, go into an alliance with uh, uh, Heyman and double cross Lesnar, that would be an amazing way to go out, that would make for an amazing SummerSlam, and it would make for the final match between these two, the greatest that it should have been, and will always be, so ladies and gentlemen, what do you guys think, do you think Paul Heyman is going to double cross Lesnar, do you think that uh, Brock, is, Brock and Paul are going to stay with each other, Put it down in the comment section, ladies and gentlemen. I always like to hear what you guys have to say. But, ladies and gentlemen, in order for me to bring you all the latest WWE news, rumors, headlines, and updates, I'm going to need you guys to like this video, favorite this video, share this on every social media platform that is humanly possible, and do me one last thing, and definitely subscribe. Thanks, guys. Love you all.